Hi there, my name is Vanessa. I would like to share a brief heartfelt message that I've written about Bible, love, and faith. The Bible, according to Encyclopedia Britannica, is defined as a book of sacred scriptures of Judaism, Jewish people, and Christianity, Gentile, non-Jewish people. These sacred scriptures consist of the Old and New Testament. A testament is a statement of belief. Jesus, who is our God and creator, took the time to provide every human being with a detailed script of his thoughts, laws, instructions, and principles, among other things. The Bible is basically God's blueprint for human life and survival. The Gospel of John chapter 3 and verse 16 is located in the New Testament and states, For God so loved the world, that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. The love that God has for every human being cannot be measured. Ancient Greeks identified four forms of love. Eros, passionate and erotic love. Philia, love of friends and equals. Storge, love of parents for children. And last but not least, agape, love of mankind. Agape in Greek is a term that expresses a fatherly love from God to and for humans. In Hebrew, agape is the term for unconditional love, which is the highest form of love. It is love that is limitless and persists regardless of circumstance. Love is God's primary attribute, hence the saying, God is love. It takes faith to love God, as well as it takes faith to believe in God. In the New Testament section of the Bible, there are letters that were written to continually encourage everyone that believes in and loves and follows God. In the letter of Hebrews, chapter 11 and verse 6, also located in the New Testament, states, But without faith it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh to God must believe that he is, and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Faith is defined as placing complete trust or confidence in someone or something. For many people today, it takes faith to get out of bed and put one foot in front of the other. Faith brings courage, strength, and determination into a person's heart to take the next step, even when they can't see the entire staircase. Faith is a choice, and that choice is one of the greatest gifts that God has given mankind. I can honestly say that I've chosen to live by faith and not by what I see. Is it a challenge? Most definitely. God has proven to me that he can handle more than my faith can reach. The life that I now live pales in comparison to the life that I used to live. Praise be to God. My faith in God has been the attributing factor for that. I am no longer a slave to sin, but I am free to be me, a woman that is ever so loved by God unconditionally. I don't just live by faith. I also walk and wear faith as I would a designer label. I hope that this message has been an inspiration to you to have faith in God and in his word, which can be found in the Bible. May God bless you.